The European Parliament doubts whether Hungary's populist government will be able to lead the EU's rotating council presidency next year. It says this is because of a major decline in democratic standards and the rule of law. On Thursday, MEPs approved a parliamentary resolution calling on the EU Council to find a proper solution, which could mean preventing Budapest from taking the lead. Hungary has been under intense scrutiny for years now. Last year, Brussels decided to freeze most of its European funds due to corruption risks and what it calls problems with democracy. We have been saying this autumn in this parliament through a resolution, we have had a huge majority in this parliament to say that Hungary is no more a complete democracy and is in a breed system between democracy and, auto and autocracy. So uh, that's the reason why we are very worried that a presidency should be held in these conditions. Prime Minister Viktor Orban's cabinet is preparing to take over the rotating presidency in mid-2024 for a period of six months. The role includes chairing and planning meetings, but also representing the EU as a whole to the outside world. MEPs believe that Orban's vow to maintain ties to Russian President Vladimir Putin and his appetite for blocking common EU goals make him unfit for the role. They're now urging the Council to stop the Hungarian EU presidency, or the Parliament says it could limit its cooperation during Budapest's term. Knowing Mr Orban, um, that he's going to use this for his own purposes to address his own audience, uh, ignore everybody else, uh, and I don't think that the European Union is the campaign team for Mr. Orban. Uh, we've allowed him to do that for the last 13 years. So uh, enough is enough. The Hungarian government rejects criticism from the European Parliament, though, insisting that it will go ahead with its presidency plans. Oh, go ahead. My favorite. Good morning. <laughs> the European Parliament does not respect European values, no democracy, no rule of law. First, they are constantly attacking uh, the free... Uh, uh, elections of Hungary and they don't accept the result that the Hungarian citizens in the name of democracy chose uh, as a government. Uh, secondly, they don't respect rule of law because uh, here the European Parliament has no role to play. The resolution of the European Parliament is non-binding, meaning the EU Council doesn't have to abide by it. So far, it's refused to discuss the issue of the Hungarian presidency.